for today. He's in uniform and ready to play, Grant. All right, thank you very much. And as we've always said, and Jerry, you know this better than anyone, players don't should They play. should be uh, worried about how well they play and how, what they can do uh, toward winning. Done. 2 nothing, Chicago. Yeah, Chris Dunn. Uh, Bank shot, 4 nothing. Yeah, Mark it in there. And the Bulls very careless with the ball. Quali Stein. Yeah, great pass there by Niminja. Up and done before he can get there. Three turnovers for Chicago. Offensive rebound. And now Bielitsa. He's been struggling, but he makes his first shot here. Very unselfish play there, buddy. But getting quality shots, that's for sure. And that, that's a good way to score. Here's and, Zach Levine. And that is Zach Levine at his best. He... Foul line fadeaway. Oh, a tough shot, but uh, I mean, I wonder how many he would make in a year. Well, and especially with uh, some of the, especially early in his career, you know, with the Jason Williams, where he could push the ball and find oh, people. Boy. The elites are posting and scoring. Now, good, good start. Good job by the Kings to find the mismatch, and it certainly was uh, Nimija inside there. Oh wow! Ooh. Ooh. Time out, Kings. Because he's really uh, made uh, the Brooklyn Nets a, a uh, playoff team. So uh, probably your top two candidates right there. And there's Selden who's just checked in. He's uh, well, haven't yet. I'm only 75. So. <laughs> there is Selden. I don't know how old Bob McAdoo was when you got your hands on. <laughs> well, he was. Play <laughs> he would qualify. A tremendous uh, building block. He may be two building blocks. I'll tell you what is very apparent as you look at Giles. When Giles and Bagley are on the floor, the Kings are so much of a better rebounding team. No fouls to use. Mark it in a short three. 6.7 left, and again, the Bulls, no fouls to give either. Bogey sees the clock, knows he has a lot of time, and now he'll fire a three. Well, Bogdanovich beats the horn. Ooh, Cabarro missed, so... Luwawu Cabarro comes in, he's had a couple good looks, not able to fall, but he healed. Nice shuffle pass to Harry Giles. And Buddy, that's just a part of his game, uh, like all parts of it. Uh, shades to wear, watching that. Harrison, nice drive and high off the glass to make it 28-25. Quick release, swish. I mean, you know, Buddy, the way he moves without the ball. Bagley takes some contact. Marvin Bagley! And a chance for a three-point play. <laughs> Are so talented all around and have the great work ethic and at attitude to go with it. But he healed just like that in double figures. Slapped away by Buddy Heald. Numbers, here come the Kings. Nice pass. Oh, that's a thing of beauty right there, Jerry. Selfish play results in a lot of good shots. Barnes. Oh, what a spin move by Barnes. Harrison Barnes. He just about the Elitza, and that looked like uh, he was fouled. I mean, it had to be something. It had to be something. I... Here's marketing. Ooh. 46 to 32. Take tough shots. You're probably going to get a low percentage. 48-32. Archie Diacono. His three is good. Now Levine drives into the basket, loses the handle, and gets it back and scores and is fouled. Yeah, I kept this dribble alive. Looked like he was going to lose the dribble, as you pointed out. And then... Lopez has not made a basket yet. He's trying to here. Well, <laughs> he was not going into the locker room without a basket. Really uh, did a great job here, especially in that second quarter. But two quarters to go. Oh, how about that pass from Cauley Stein? And Willie Cauley Stein again showing you the ability from the high post. Here's Porter getting around one. Fouled and the basket counts. All right, so the Kings lead 62 to 45. And De'Aaron Fox, he hits a three ball. That's the biggest lead of the game for Sacramento. Well, these guys have a lot of confidence in their ability, and they know that uh, they, they still believe they got a chance at the playoffs, and then they're playing like it, and that's what you want to see. Buddy Hill now with 12. Jim Boylan, he takes a timeout. He clicks all those boxes. Marketing. Laurie Marketing makes it. Buddy Hill still in the ball. Numbers, 
Corey Stein. He's with Belly. The bounce pass. Back to him. Oh, a thing of beauty. If you don't like that, you don't like Kings basketball. Well, that's a big word there. You, arduous, I've been studying it? up on that. that. That means like really uh, difficult? Yes. Okay. You know, he's, there's just so many things you can say about him, and all of them are true if it's positive. Otto Porter now with eight. The best comeback you've seen in person? It's the best one I've ever seen. Yeah. I mean, because that was in an 18 minute stretch, too. Yes, it was. Uh, you know, about six minutes to go in the third, down 35, and that was a playoff team they beat. Bagley guarding Porter, knocked it away. Fox, numbers. Oh, boy, a little careless there, but the Kings do recover and get it to Harrison Barnes. Mm -hmm. well, 83 58. Levine, a deep three. Oh, and he got a nice roll there. Wow, that's a shooter's bounce. Sure is, 83-61. Three more for De'Aaron Fox. He has 17. Well, that just makes the game. Kings look to run. Four bulls are back. Bagley to Giles. Get used to that, Kings fans. You're going to be seeing that for many, many, many years to come. Bagley one-on-one -on, -one on Selden. Boy, does he make the game look easy, Jerry. He really does. I mean, uh, you see the complete repertoire that he has, obviously. Job by Archie Diacono following up his miss. Again, that guy goes full tilt. Here is TLC. Connects. There was a little TLC. Just a, you could have about five rookies of the year. Yeah, because, I mean, Jerry Jackson's good. Yeah. And yeah. how about, how about uh, Shea Gilgis-Alexander? Shea Gilgis-Alexander yeah. uh, really uh, deserves in the consideration as well. And, uh, so it's just a... Can you even remotely compare him to anyone? The only one I can, uh, to some degree, is Charles Barkley. But, uh, but I, I, and of course, I watch Charles. I think uh, Zion is uh, a notch above. I mean, that's, that's, he's a special, special case. Bogdanovich, and look at that score. Selden, four to shoot. Archie Diacono, the runner, good. And there's 8.1. First uh, minutes for Yogi Ferrell. Bagley stays with it. Wow, Marvin Bagley! Marvin Bagley, 19 points. And the bogey with his sixth rebound. Yogi Farrell, now he's into the scoring ledger. And here we are in March, and Harry's getting more and more playing time. Look at that pass, Jerry. Well, and I mean, again, he, he is the real deal. He is. Boy, that's a heck of an effort by the Bulls getting yeah, blown out playing yeah. like that. And Harrison makes uh, the conversion. Harrison. Cross court. Oh, and a chance for a four-point play. Yogi Ferrell running in the TLC. TLC, three-pointer. He's got nine. Bagley finds Frank Mason. Frank all the way! Timeout bowls. Yogi. You know, this game becomes much easier when nobody guards you. And Costa grabbing, and Harrison makes the basket. Just get ready for the road. Just win, win, win. Take it one at a time. And that's going to be an opportunity for a three-point play. And didn't miss they make, a beat. They got better. They, they yeah. make an argument they got better. They won seven of ten. You know, Doc has just done it. Of course, he's always been a great coach. Williams. And Lou Williams yeah, and Montrez Harrell. Yeah, it's nice. I mean, those guys are yeah. ever night. Post yeah. Kufus. Well, what a nice afternoon for the Kings. They beat the Bulls soundly twice this year. Held them to 89 points in Chicago earlier in the year. And tonight, or I should say this afternoon, they roll 129 to 102.